painting fell off the wall and it was in, I don't know, six or seven, eight pieces, big, just cut in many, many, many pieces. And several of the pieces I had to just collect them to bring to Morris with the destroyed, damaged painting. And it looks fabulous now. Uh, I can't believe it will look, but it could look like this again. I can't even tell there was so many tears. I know. Anyway, so there was quite a few. I'd say six or seven pieces, some of them tiny, some of them a little bit larger. And it was just all through. Uh, it was just ripped all through my painting. So uh, the, the frame, oh, the frame was terrible too. It, just chunks and chunks of my frame was gone. Um, it just looks fabulous, it really does. So you did a fabulous job. I'm very thrilled to have it back. That's so awesome. how about a little bit history of the painting? A little bit of history of the painting? Mm -hmm. Well, the painting is a family piece. My grandmother is the one that purchased it. I don't know exactly where or when, but it was passed down from my grandmother to my mother to me. I've had it for, I don't know, 35 years or maybe, yeah, about 35 years, something like that. And then of course it was my grandmother's. So I don't know exactly when she purchased it. That's all I know about it. Um, okay, yeah, so um, what, what I think is a, it's, uh, it's a French, definitely, it's a French art. And yes, it's um, French painting. French mm -hmm. painting at the Barbizon School. Mm -hmm. And I suspect it's just like it's um, artist um, by artist Corot, or actually his, uh, his, his close disciples because of uh, the, how the trees was done. Mm -hmm. And uh, when you work in restoration, you could see the quality, unbelievable quality, just like of each inch has its own um new color uh, new color nothing you know repeats and when the painting was cleaned just like i was astonished myself like so of the quality of the work um so i think it's a french uh, coral uh, uh and it's uh, since the label states too that it's like french it's um uh, uh, friend coming from Fr France and uh, it's a French stretcher uh, stretcher bar that actually was uh, painting was stretched on so you have one interesting valuable piece here but the main thing it is of course it will be next uh, not to find a provenance on it but the next uh, it's do you like uh, restoration work oh yes I love the restoration work I mean, it's beautiful. I can't believe it can be this way. You can't again. tell it was torn. Uh -uh. No, no. And my son that broke it, he'll be so happy to see it. So, uh, to me, you can still tell that it's very old, but I can't tell where it was torn at all. Yes, and, and uh, I would, uh, later with, with this video, we'll, uh, we'll post to some of the photos, mm -hmm. uh, photos uh, that uh, you took and I took, just like the, uh, the painting was so many pieces was there, so... Um, you can't so tell so. where the new paint was applied to it at all. Mm -mm. No, it's beautiful. You did a wonderful job. I mean... Okay. When I brought it to you, I thought, oh no, I hope you don't tell me you can't take this on because this is my favorite piece of my collection, my small little collection from my family. Yeah, no, you have a good pieces, yeah. It's all like a lot of them too, French. And... Okay, very happy. I'm just like happy that you're happy. So, and uh, it's... Um, very, very happy. Mm. So, we're painting now to, to go for next generations. Mm -hmm. To live on. Or sell it and pay off our mortgage. Oh, oh yes! <laughs> <laughs> Let's do that! <laughs> okay. Okay, thank you guys. Thank, thank you. you. Okay. <laughs>